Audrey Hepburn, who was a great British actress and humanitarian, once said, as you grow older, you get to discover that you have two hands, one for helping yourself and the other for helping others. Yeah, don't be confused. You know, I'm going to explain why I came out with this code, but don't forget to watch weekly entertainment trends wait on Ghana's number one entertainment channel, GET. Make sure you like this video, you comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that. My name is Grace Jesse. You can simply call me Elulu. Over the years, Ghanaians come out to complain that despite the fact that you know they've given, they've put in so much energy to help the creative uh, people. I'm talking about the musicians and the movie, you know, industry people. The ability for them to come out to give back to the society is very scarce. And Daddy Lumba has been one person that has been criticized a lot. That despite the fact that you know a lot of people come out to support him, you know, the fans have you know supported his career all this while. By his ability to come out, to give out to the community for the help and all that he has received is very scarce. We hardly see things like that. Now, Charles Kwaijo Fosu, popularly known as Daddy Lumba, has launched a radio station here in Accra called DL 106.9 FM. Now, this is a great way or a beautiful way to give back to society. Because this is not only going to create employment, but also going to help promote the young ones coming up in the music industry. And of course, I saw a quote of, you know, the DLFM saying a home, home of great music. So definitely, they are going to promote good music and, you know, promote the young ones, you know, coming into the, the music space. It's a great one to give back to the community. Congratulations to um, Daddy Lumba. Now away from Daddy Lumba, December is fast approaching and we all know December is a very busy month for the creative industry. I mean, there's going to be a lot of shows and, you know, enjoyment and stuff. And Afro Tela and Afro Nation is going to be happening in December as well. And guess what? Banner Boy and Stone Boy are going to headline Afro Tela coming 28th and 29th of December. These two great musicians are going to headline Afrochella. Everyone knows Stoneboy actually had um, a, a summer to the world some few days back and it was crazy. Like, it was so amazing. And Benna Boy, oh my God, he's also killing it out there. Great performance, you know, from Benna Boy, wherever he goes, any stage he climbs and stuff. So, December is going to be brutal. And Afro Nation is also going to headline, is going to be headlined by Davido and P-Square. You know, since square i mean mr p and rude boy came together they have been having great you know performances on stage and stuff and afro nation is going to be headlined by davido and p square and a special guest for afro nation this december is going to be stone boy guys be like say stone boy won't get all the gigs this december but anyway he deserves it he has worked hard this year i'm going to have the artists like rema adequately good ck um Kamido, Kwame Yujin, KD, Jackie perform also at Afro Nation. And guys, we're going to be bringing you all the updates on Afrochella and Afro Nations. So stay tuned and make sure you watch weekly entertainment trends wait on Ghana's number one entertainment channel, GET. My name still remains Great Jesse. You can simply call me Elulu. And thanks for watching this episode.